we are talking about life cycle will be having three different type of life cycle in case of plants what are these three different type of life cycles which we will be dealing with so we'll start with your haplontic life cycle okay so for haplontic life cycle what we will see if a plant is haploid in nature remember if any plant is haploid in nature what we call them we call them gametophyte okay so if a plant is haploid in nature then it will be known as gametophyte so we'll see a haplontic life cycle where we are representing a plant by gametophyte now remember this now this gametophyte plant want to go for a sexual reproduction okay it is haploid in nature for going into sexual reproduction it need gametes now tell me one thing if you want to form a haploid structure from a haploid organism what you will go for which kind of division will you go for ha huh? mitosis we'll go for mitotic right we'll go for the mitotic division right so we will have a mitotic division so we'll have a mitotic division here and with the help of the mitotic division what we will be getting is two haploid gametes so these are my gametes now these gametes will fuse with each other see i am drawing a very basic life cycle okay when we are dealing with different groups of plant kingdom then we will have a different um, structures which will be coming up there so this will lead to the formation of zygote now what is this process known as this process is known as the syngamy or in other term will say fusion or if you want to say we can call it fertilization okay so we will have syngamy fusion or fertilization and what we will uh, get we'll get a zygote now try to understand one important thing sir this zygote is deployed in nature and the main plant body is haploid in nature so what this zygote need to do this zygote need to do which kind of division to be converted into the haploid structure which kind of division sir meiosis obviously meiosis, meiosis. right so we'll have meiosis here yeah? now the meiosis is taking place in case of zygote so this kind of meiosis is known as zygotic meiosis which will lead to the formation of spores now this spores will lead to the formation of the gametophyte so we are going to say the spore will germinate into a gametophyte now coming to the next point sir what are the things which you have to remember haplontic life cycle will have a zygotic meiosis this is important sir okay and they are not they can ask directly haplontic life cycle will have which kind of meiosis or they can ask something like this they go on to give you examples they going to tell you that we have chlamydomonas okay we have chlamydomonas we have spirogera okay they can take any example chlamydomonas or spirogera or they going to take the name of eulothrix okay so we have this organisms they gonna go for a sexual reproduction tell me which kind of meiosis you gonna see there your answer should be zygotic meiosis is it clear now along with this algae we also have some other organisms like cellular slime mold which also undergo the same kind of life cycle we have fungi which also undergo the same kind of life cycle so for their cases also will have the zygotic meiosis sir now there is a term which we going to discuss which is very much important for plant kingdom and they usually ask question on it which is known as alteration of generation now if you see this term you can easily understand alteration means changes of generation which changes are you talking about you are saying you are having a haploid phase you are also having a diploid phase now the question which they ask which of the following mechanism are very much important 
for alteration of generation okay so if we see here from haploid to diploid if you want to make a cell from haploid to diploid you need syngamy right you need to fuse two different type of cells here which are haploid in nature and if you want to change a diploid into a haploid structure you need meiosis and this in other term can also be known as reductive division or reduction division so you should also remember one thing alteration of generation is an important feature of plant kingdom and this particular feature required two important processes one is known as syngamy one is known as your reductive division or reduction division known as meiosis is it clear is yes, it clear sir okay 